Jason Zimmerman joins us today, talks some Emory men's basketball. Uh, coach, uh, what a difference a week uh, can make. A couple weeks ago, we're coming off a couple of road losses, but uh, this past weekend, wins at home over uh, Case, Western, and Carnegie. Yeah, it's always nice to come home. Uh, it's always nice to play at home, especially in our league. A lot of travel uh, that you, you got to get done, and uh, it's uh, it's exciting to travel to those places and going, but it's it's challenging. And uh, of course, now we get ready to go back on the road after our home home weekend. But we came back this weekend and, and focused on ourselves, what we need to do to get better. I thought we were uh, a little bit better offensively cutting, moving better without the ball. Uh, and then defensively, uh, I thought we had a little bit better edge, especially on, on Sunday, for sure. Uh, you know, uh, obviously on Friday night, uh, Alex Foster came through with his usual strong 24 points. Uh, yeah, a big contribution from, from Austin to Goo, career high 16 points in that game. Yeah, you know, Austin's been playing better and better uh, the last couple weeks. And, uh, you know, he made shots, uh, finished plays around the rim. On, on Friday, and uh, you know, he, and then he moved on to the next play. You know, he, he whether he made it or missed it or you know, made a mistake, he moved on to the next play, kept playing, and he's been doing that very well. And we're looking forward for that this coming weekend. And then on Sunday, it was this kind of uh, I, I haven't seen that in a while here. Forty three eleven halftime lead. You guys just really just seemed to get on a roll in that first half, and just, it seemed to snowball in your favor. Yeah, it, it snowballed both ways. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, Carnegie's much better uh, than they played in, in the first half, and. And we played pretty well in the first half, so it was a combination of those things. And uh, you know, the second half we got beat in the second half of that game, and uh, something that we talk about. You know, we have to be better at that. But uh, you know, it was it was nice to come out and uh, and start off well. Uh, we started off uh, a little weekend before on the road. Where I think we had talked about we lost nine of the ten first half rounds, and um, we just have to be better there. And Sunday's game, we were a little bit better. Uh, at that, we got a, a sizable lead, and then uh, I would like to see the intensity stay where it was in the second half, and we dro we dropped off a little bit there. Oh, it's okay. Well, now those games are in the books, and you got another road weekend coming up, starting Friday at Brandeis, and then Sunday at uh, uh, NYU, who would crack the national rankings. Yeah, um, we you know we haven't I haven't looked at NYU yet. So I've been watching Brandeis, and uh, very young. Uh, talented group, and uh, they have some great wins. I mean, beat Amherst by 20, uh, beat Chicago uh, this past weekend, beat NYU. Uh, you know, they, they've had some good wins this year, and, um, and I think they're, they're maturing uh, as the season goes on. And so it's going to be a challenge on Friday night at Brandeis. And then uh, you know, head to NYU, we'll figure that out on Saturday. You know, and looking at the Brandeis statistics, one thing they do, I think they're at the top of the league in, in scoring defense. Yes, and uh, they play a little bit more deliberate offensively, mm -hmm. so that helps your. You know, if you're looking at points uh, you know, per game, you know, if they play a little bit more deliberate offensively, that you know, that can hold your defensive uh, points per game down. But they, they are very, uh, uh, they lock in defensively and they guard you in half court. We're going to have to, uh, we have to play well offensively. You know, execute, cut hard, you know, pass and catch, just the simple things that. Uh, you know, we have some guys that can score. We have some guys that can make shots, but we have to put ourselves in positions to, to get better shots. All right, Coach. Well, we'll let you get back to work. Thanks very much for your time, and uh, we will catch up with you later. Thanks, Sean.